<laughs> I was doing the interview and I knew Marquez was on the other end and they didn't know I knew that, but someone gave me some information, so I called him out. It was just playful, actually, because I didn't think that fight would ever happen because the weight, the weights and so forth, but then they start talking about it. But I don't think it's gonna, I don't think it's gonna be, I don't think that will happen, but I, I think it would be a great fight, but I think, you know, Marquez would need a tune-up fight and we, we just don't have time for the tune-up fight in that way and so forth. So we are we are looking to fight maybe um, a little later this year, but there's, there's, there's no opponent yet. And Gabby is giving me a couple names, and um, I've, I've said yes to a couple and no to a couple. I said I said no to Amir Khan, actually. Really? Why did you say no to that fight? Um, at this point, I just uh, I, I I don't think we want to fight a guy that's gonna gonna run and make us try to make us look bad and so forth. I, I think Miguel, after uh, coming off a loss like a very a close loss in his last fight, I think we need to be a little bit impressive to keep the crowd on our side. So it seems like Cotto was maybe his first choice, and he went to Canelo. Well, yeah. Okay, guys, really quick, we need to start getting everybody ready. Um, a few breaking stories here. Uh, one of them is uh, Robert Garcia and Brian Rios splitting after you know a, a great run. Uh, what's your take on that? Who's splitting? Brian Rios and Robert Garcia. They, oh, yeah? they decided to part ways and, and, and continue their careers uh, separately. Uh, you know, I, I, I can't. I, 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 it's funny, but you know, it's like when things happen, and, you know, when when people lose and so forth, people get fired, and usually it's the coach and stuff like that. So, um, um, and uh, that's part of part of life. But you know, I had a big blow last time when Luis uh, Bernardo came up to me and he said, "Ready." I just want to make a decision that I'm going to go somewhere else because I don't think I have you have enough time for me, and I you know and I, I want to I want every opportunity I can to, to do better in my next fight. So I I would shook his hand and wished him best of luck. So this happens in, in boxing, but you know, sometimes good, sometimes bad. You know, is Teddy Atlas really a better trainer or a better storyteller than the you know the Joe Diaz? I, I'm not sure, but the thing is, it's how the fight. The five doesn't turn to get along, it, it, what counts. Okay, thank you. Thanks, Freddie. Um, let's